So um, I'm going to go over the, um, the areas that need to be given priority for the ongoing school improvement, okay? And these are going to be a combination of things that, that the previous committee recommended, um, things that, um, and this is on page four, if you have a copy in front of you. Um, the previous committee recommended, we saw and we discussed with you, and you appeared to see the same things that we saw, okay? So um, this committee recommends that Pathway Charter School continue to address the following areas for school improvement. So number one is staff, under the leadership of the executive director, area coordinators and department chairs, implement a comprehensive system of standards-aligned benchmark assessments for grades K-8. These benchmarks and associated outcomes will be used to inform parents, students, and independent study teachers regarding student acquisition of standards, and the analysis will inform school officials making instructional and curricular decisions. Okay? The second one, area coordinators, department chairs, and the curriculum coordinator will continue to refine the college prep course program to reflect instructional and curricular coherence and to promote appropriate rigor as required. Strive to perfect the system of diagnostic assessment used for placement, common end of course assessments and portfolios to measure mastery, and reflective analysis of CST data to evaluate the program. And then the third one is that school leadership will document, report, and archive school-wide student achievement data on standards-based assessments. And that could include things like the CSTs, the KC, the K-8 benchmarks, the high school objectives for the core courses, and other things. Don't let us limit you in the data that you collect and use, okay? Um, and other objective measures, as well as demonstrated student acquisition of the expected school-wide learning results, or ESLERs. Reports to stakeholders will include analysis of the data disaggregated by subpopulations and how the analysis is effectively used to guide future decisions. So a lot of this is, is stuff that you've already said and you're already aware of and, and, uh, um, and um, then Robert is going to talk, I mean, you're not Robert, you're Don. Don's going to talk to you a little bit about um, about what we see as really positive aspects of the of the school. Right, and I would just uh, mention for, for myself, I've enjoyed uh, my visit. I've learned a lot uh, more about independent study programs and, and homeschool and uh, truly enjoy getting to meet the students. Uh, they mm -hmm. are uh, passionate advocates of this program, which speaks volumes to us uh, about the quality of your program and uh, your commitment to, to your students and to your families. Uh, we recognize that you have an action plan and that hopefully uh, through what, what Karen just presented, you might be able to provide a little more focus and refine it to something that's doable and measurable and uh, accomplishable in the next between you now and your next visit. We see many good things while we're here and we've uh, identified that uh, all stakeholders at Pathways Charter, we want to commend all stakeholders holders at Pathways Charter School for the sustainability and growth in the quality of student programs and student achievement during times of considerable transitions and challenges. Uh, in spite of changes in leadership and, uh, and in, uh, bringing a new board uh, on board, uh, the transition seems seamless. And your students and your parents um, uh, told us those things and said, look, we know there were some uh, issues in leadership, but it didn't affect the bottom line, which was quality education for our kids. And you're to be commended for that. The committee commends the Pathways Independent Study Teachers, Department Chairs, and Area Coordinators for the high degree of professionalism demonstrated during collaboration among staff from all three learning center locations in regards to sharing best teaching practices and developing authentic measures for academic content standards and expected school-wide learning results. Uh, we were impressed with the uh, amount of professional conversation and interchange that you have amongst yourself. That really demonstrates a healthy professional culture, uh, one that, uh, you know, maybe could be replicated other places. You know, they could kind of, that's where we want to head as, as educators, that we get to that place where we're really sharing our, our ideas and our best practices. The committee commends students, families, and teachers, support staff, school administration, and board members for their passion and dedication to Pathways Charter School. The professional culture is healthy. The educators are dedicated to continuous improvement, and students are benefiting from the program. And I'd just like to add that uh, you took the last set of recommendations seriously. You've got your, um, your writing uh, assessment in place for 9-12, you're working on your benchmarks, you're analyzing data, all those things that uh, uh, were presented and 
I want to thank you for um, your commitment to that. And we're convinced that it's going to uh, continue. And again, thank you for allowing me to be part of your family for a while. I appreciate and, that. And I, too, I too just want to say thanks for being such gracious hosts. We, we have felt very comfortable and taken care of. Our needs were met. So I, I do want to, again, say thanks for that and, um, okay, and one letting thing. us come in. Nope. Yeah, which one? Yeah, go ahead. Well, because I know this is going to be viewed by the Board of Directors, and uh, we were impressed that they're looking to be more involved and more informed mm -hmm. as the leaders of uh, this school and their commitment uh, to that uh, was impressive and they speak uh, highly of you and they appreciate your efforts for their children for everyone's children and uh, I'm gonna get the last word because I'm really the visiting committee chairperson okay. so right. I just want <laughs> I just it. want to say that you're doing great things for kids so keep doing it yeah. thanks a lot thank you, thank you. Right. Thank you. okay bye <laughs>